I enjoy when I play soccer. I try to respect uh, all my teammates, uh, respect the, the rivals, uh, respect the, the fans and the media also. And uh, I will try to do my, my job in the best uh, way. Uh, I love soccer and uh, I don't know, I think the, the people, uh, uh, they can decide no? when uh, it's my position in the, in the club or in the history in La Liga. But uh, for me, this is not the, the most important, is uh, to live every day, the detail, the simple, simple things. Uh, I like that. Um, yeah. When you played, um, when you scored your many goals, you used to kiss your wedding ring. You're a very proud family man, yeah? Um, what is the most unusual celebration that you've seen other players do? Oh my God, they are a crazy celebration. I don't know. I think uh, sometimes I like, uh, and other times I don't like. I think the simple celebration is, uh, for me, is, uh, is, uh, is the best. <laughs> the, the correct uh, way, you know? <laughs> the right way. Uh, I mean, did you used to think of your family when, when you were celebrating? What, what used to go through your mind in those moments? Yeah, for me, the, my family, uh, my wife, uh, we create an amazing family for, with uh, five kids. And uh, of course, my parents, uh, my brother, my sister, uh, all the family around. But uh, for me, my, my, my pillar in my life is, uh, is my wife. You know? We create an amazing family. And also, when I score, when, when I score goals uh, before, uh, always it was uh, for, her, for her and uh, for my kids. You know? uh, football has given you an amazing life. What do yes. you think you would have been if you weren't playing football? Oh, and if, when I was uh, when I was a kid, a boy, I always a doctor. I think if uh, I would like to play soccer, and otherwise I would medical uh, doctor uh, like uh, to to help to the animals. I don't know what you say in English. That veterinarian, I yeah. think veterinarian. Uh, it was uh, my other uh, my other way, but uh, luckily uh, I was soccer player, uh, I can enjoy the, my, my dream. No? I think you would have been a very good vet, um, but a fantastic <laughs> footballer, obviously. <laughs> if you were still back home at, in Spain, you would no. be recognized all the time. How, <laughs> how, how often do you get recognized in New York? No, here is perfect. It's, a, <laughs> it's like a paradise for me. <laughs> <laughs> I can take the subway every day to to arrive to the office. I can work with my with my kids. Of course, there are uh, also there are a lot of tourists. There are people that they like uh, soccer here in in New York, and sometimes they they recognize me. But uh, um, I can live um, uh, quiet, not like in Spain, no. Mm -hmm. But uh, well, in Spain, in my city, Madrid, uh, well, it's my city, no. It's like. Uh, uh, is I, always I feel uh, very good when I come back to, to Spain. No? When you played, you wore the number seven for most of your career, and that really became a part of your identity. I, I wonder what does that number, the number seven, mean to you now? When you see the number seven, what do you think? Uh, I think for for Real Madrid, the number seven is a, like a symbol. No, the, they. They play a big uh, names in the history of the club, no? With the number seven, no? Uh, Emilio Butragueño, uh, Amancio, uh, Juanito. Is uh, this number is like uh, something symbolic for the club, no? All the numbers is uh, uh, is important. Not it's important the number, no? You know the the, the Real Madrid, no? Uh, but uh, but especially in the in this club, the number seven is something special. But I think it's is not the most important, but for me it was a big honor to uh, to take uh, this jersey during 17 or 15, 16 uh, season. No?